Welcome back to the Caribou Data Science Channel, or since it's your Caribou Data Science Channel, where the data science is all about your needs, you and your needs, okay? Also, Rumble folks, if you're joining me here for the high report, be sure to uh, smash that embed button and, and smash the the Rumble button. Share this video with one friend, one of your Rumble friends today. Also, be sure to also YouTube. Don't forget to smash the like button and smash the share button. Share this video with one person from Buckeye Nation today. Okay, thanks so much. Let's get on with the show. I will mention these these numbers may be changing over the last couple of days because 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 Ohio just went back and crazy enough to just re, just revise their death counts all the way back to uh, to April. Now my guess is what you know. Did, did my concern is did the only change the death counts? What about cases? Okay. I'm 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 also keeping the the raw data set which has the bad numbers in it. Okay. Uh, so far, I only I only know for sure that uh, that uh, John Hopkins University is the only one that actually made changes to their numbers. Okay. Okay, so take a look here. Ohio currently has 941,000 cases, 16,394 deaths. Uh, you can see that if you throw out this number here, the mortality rate still remains fairly low, so apparently they haven't changed these numbers yet. But what you can see here, you can see cases are, are declining. And you can see cases, deaths, may, what you throw out, again, we throw out this spike here. We may be able to see some decline in deaths also. These, of course, are 60-day moving averages. And you can see the problem right here with cases. One, two, well, let's see, one, two, three, four, five. So you can see the cases have declined in uh, two, three, four, six, six weeks. So, so, so cases have declined for six straight weeks, but they finished below this number here for uh, nine weeks, okay? Deaths uh, haven't changed much here. Okay. Okie dokie. Now, obviously, these add, these these add on to the desk just 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 blew our monthly death right out of the water. I'm sorry. Okay, so these are the five counties. These are the five counties in Ohio with the with the most cases in the last seven days. Chicago, Franklin had over 150, 175 cases in the last seven days. Hamilton had 10 deaths. As you can see Franklin County here. You got all these negative numbers here. Probably a correction from some other time. Downward trend in cases. Uh -oh. Deaths, it looks like they're maybe starting to trend back up. All this number could be wrong. I wonder if the, you know, uh, I wonder if Ohio only gave state level numbers and not county level numbers. Okay. So, like I say, be prepared for a shock in the next couple of days. These numbers will certainly change dramatically. Uh, well, they'll certainly notice we changed. Notice, I'm not going to say dramatically yet. Okay, so that concludes the report for the U.S. for today. Remember to come. Remember to come back on. Oh, this is Ohio. I'm sorry. Remember, remember, folks, to, to click that like on YouTube, click the like button, and click the share button. Share this video with one person today, one buck on Buckeye, one buck that you know today. So, so on, on Rumble, share this, share this video with one person from the Buckeye Nation. All you're gonna do is click the Rumble button and click the share button, okay, or, or click the embed button and share the link. Okay, thanks so much for your time today, folks. We'll catch you with another report.